We begin our meditation in the usual way by centering ourselves and creating a space to be present to this moment. We draw our attention to our breath. We are aware of the natural ebb and flow of our breathing, but more tuned into it. What it feels like as the air fills our lungs. What it feels like as we exhale that warm air warmed by our bodies out. And as we breathe a little deeper, we are intentional about relaxing, scanning the body for any spots of tension or discomfort breathing into that and really allowing that to settle us. And we draw our attention to the mind. And continuing to focus on our breathing, we want to clear a space for our meditation tonight. And so we let go of whatever's on our minds right now, not worrying about where we've been or where we have to go or what we have to do. Allowing us to just be present to this moment. And if we find ourselves distracted, we return again to our breath. And again, focus on our breathing so that we can create that sacred space. This meditation continues our Advent focus on the three candle Sundays of Advent and tonight's meditation is on hope. Hope is a wholly unique concept. It's different than a wish or even an intention. A wish is simply putting something we desire out into the universe and hoping in some way that it comes true but without the trust and faith that it will. An intention involves a commitment on our part to be intentional, like for example, to the practice of meditation or whatever it is that we put our mind to. But hope has a spiritual component that is grounded in trust and faith.
a long time ago, I learned that a good way to pray is to speak or share with God what it is we desire in an attitude of gratitude as if God is already making it happen. And in some way, hope is like that. And although we may not always get what we hope for in exactly the way we thought it might be, we do always get an answer, a resolution. And so, for tonight's meditation, I invite you first to think of something that you hope for. Again, not a wish or an intention, a hope, a deep desire within you. It may be about you, it may be about someone else or something else. It may be something very important and dear to you, or it may be something very simple. Whatever it is, bring it to mind. And continuing to focus on your breath, just picture that hope. What does it look like? Now I invite you to visualize that as if it has happened. And then we spend a moment in gratitude. With faith and trust that our hope is realized, we give thanks. I invite you to spend a few moments in that hope, being attentive to what it feels like to have that hope fulfilled. to be in a place of trust and faith.
What does it feel like? Where do you feel it in your body? Have you felt this way before? And what were the circumstances of that feeling? Or is this a unique experience? comfortable in that space of hope. Let's try this again. Again, visualize something that you hope for, big or small, specific or ethereal. And again, breathe in to that visualization with the hope and assurance that it will be. Before we draw this meditation to a close, I want you to remember this exercise. 
so that you can be in that space of hope. Anytime you want to go there, that space of assurance and faith and trust. And I want to offer a little caution or clarification. This is not magical thinking. This meditation is not the idea that if we just think it, it will be. It is putting ourselves in a space of hope. It is a form of prayer, of sharing intention with faith that there will be resolution and confidence that that resolution is what is to be and that all will be well. And so returning to the breath, you take three deep breaths. and grateful for the gift of hope. We draw this meditation to a close. And when you are ready, you can open your eyes.